Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Welcome back to the channel. Today, as you can see from the thumbnail, we are going back to San Mateo. Before that, we gotta get a cold start on the Alfa Romeo 4C. We also need some Phil's coffee and also... Yeah, I wasn't given much room to get out of here, but maybe I could squeeze on through. Oh, right. Also, a couple things to take note of. I'm almost at 20,000 miles in the 4C, and I got a half a tank of gas. That half a tank of gas is, that's $5 gas. Remember when gas was $5? Yeah, it's probably six now. Got my fills fixed. If you didn't know, Ambrosia of God. Yeah, in case you guys ever want to buy me a cup. Yeah, the sun is glaring, but yeah, there's fills right there. And yeah, we need to head out. San Mateo. Super nice Supra coming through. Look at that. Woo. We got an E46 M3 and I think a E90 or one of those is behind me. We got the two BMWs next to each other. We got the E46 right next to that. We got the E90. Approaching the cars and coffee 991 Porsche 911 right in front of us and right behind us something nice as well And of course we are entering through the rear as we do. Oh right here. We are we got my 4c Glistening in the Sun. There we are Maybe you could see the pearl maybe not This Aston Martin this one we saw last time has that very nice wood trim inside, but what is even crazier is this engine super nice yeah we have our friends rs4 so i parked next to this this thing's really nice rare to see as well and another audi right next to it as well the tt we have our friends lucid air yeah this is clean wish i could get one of these you guys know i'm looking for an electric car gonna sell the LS 430 that would be really nice to have this but this might be out of the price range for now mm -hmm. beautiful 911 and then the Datsun right behind it we've seen that one before as well the Benz just screaming out luxury all right we'll take a look at the Corvette row we got like Porsche row over there and then it looks like Corvette row over on this side with a few C7s see a c6 c5 and for the og ones yeah nice photo on there those are our friends corvette and you got a really nice really nice photo right up front really nice spec on this one let's see if our friend kevin shows up as well yeah right behind the 992 you got this lotus with the doors that go up and it also has a track spec sticker so that's pretty cool yeah <laughs> wow, that is clean. We got a look at the front of the Lotus with the Lambo doors. It's cool. It looks like it's smiling at me. We got Michael Beyond City Limits is RSX Type S right here. Got the 992, a couple of C7s, and right next to the C7s, we got a wild truck. That thing is crazy. So, yeah, got the pickup truck. Oh yeah, here goes the Resto Mod. We'll get back to the pickup truck in a bit, but the Mercedes Goldwing Resto Mod, that thing's super nice. But yeah, we'll check out the truck. Streaming out 90s, we got the Alpine. It might be a pullout stereo or at least a face-off stereo. Looks like we have one switch up there. It's maybe for this. And then we got a couple 15 Rockford Fosgates and a GT bike. The GT bike, man, that was my thing. Dinos, GT bikes. Um, yeah, didn't do skateboarding, did bicycling. Then going back in the interior, you got all these mirrors. You got the old school cell phone. Actually, car phone, because it wasn't like you could take it with you anywhere. Yeah, you got Erica pulling up in the Spider 997 Turbo. I think we've talked to him before. E46. And Super nice Ferrari coming up. Wow. 
a nice color. The Resto Mod parking out of the sunlight. We'll get you the going doors. Oh yeah, that's cool. What's up, Michael? <laughs> Good, how are you? Good to see you too. All right, really loving the color on this Audi. It's hard to tell. Hopefully you can see it, but in some lights it almost has a green, but it's like a black. It could also be my sunglasses, so. If you guys are thinking germs are tripping, that's black. That's, that's my bad. Yeah, carbon fiber wing. Carbon fiber inside the engine bay. You got the GTS. Would you call this two-tone? More than likely, yes. Oh, well, oh, hello, doggo. Hi. We got the BMW that I think Erica was talking about in the Mexican blue. And from what she was telling me, this is technically a Porsche color on a BMW. Uh, really nice. You get a better look at the Datsun. Look at that carbon fiber lip. Super nice. Ooh. Look at the wang. You got the GT headed out, or at least moving spots, and the R8. Ooh, that sounds good. Oh yeah, that's a nice color. Beautiful 996 turbo. You got what, 993 next to it, and what was this, a GT4? Yeah, 944 Porsche row. Oh, look at this how. I don't know if this is the chalk color, but the wheels definitely match on that. And a few more Porsches out here. Yeah, Porsches rolled out deep today. And speaking of Porsches, we have another one here, but the one we want to look at, or at least I mean by we, I mean me, is Erica's paint the sample spider. And right behind it, yeah, got my 4C. Super nice if you haven't seen it before on the channel. Got the E36 M3. And again, Erica's Spider. All right, this is really nice to see a couple of chargers. And we got different generations, of course, but both in the same color. Super nice to see those together. And yes, the Taurus. Is it a SHM? And you got. BMW and a Mustang right behind it and next to that the 997 Turbo S or RS it says and we got a DeLorean yeah, I recently saw a DeLorean online that was painted black that looked really good this is the iconic colorway if you call it that but just all metal but it did look good in black our friends 996 Turbo and yeah he drives this thing you know you'll see him multiple car meets in one day just like I do sometimes. And yeah, check out the Prelude right next to this E46. The Prelude is like a pickup and it's got this crazy bike on it. That's all carbon fiber. Yeah, super nice V-dub, buggy, really nice color, slammed to the ground, nice headlights, and beautiful 997. This thing is super sick, really crazy color. Got the newer style headlights. It looks more modern. Crazy wheels on that. It's the back. God, it's nice. You can see right through there. This thing's super sick. Definitely one of my favorites out here today. You know, Type R, man. Type R's are getting very expensive. And right behind that, we have an M4 CS. I was able to see our friends and tear on these and they're crazy the amount of carbon fiber they have i think they even have that recycled carbon fiber on the door i'm not sure if this one has it but i think it's super nice Woo! here we go oh that sounds so good got yeah, a couple of cool looking v-dubs here next to some bmws and this Cobra and the Ferrari. This thing is so nice. Man, it's so sleek looking. I know they haven't changed the body design on this in a while, but it still looks really good. Look at this thing. Is that the Hollywood? Super nice. 
which was the interior. Body. The body was exactly the same. Wow, super comfy. Get the Mustang rolling through again, the Cobra. Oh, love that. Love that. Got the Maserati rolling out. Oh God, that sounds good too. Got the SVT pickup truck. Really nice color on this one. Really nice. <laughs> That's insane. Love that. You know, nice Integra with the JDM style headlights. 2002. And then I really like the color on this Mercedes Benz. It's like a tan or a sand. Super nice. And then next to the Mercedes, we got yeah BMW Row. Oh, oh, what the heck was that? Okay. <laughs> Oh, I really like the Fitman wheels on this. That's nice. Oh, what what is making that sound? Oh, it's probably the Mustang. Yeah, that sounds good. Oh, 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 this one's rolling out too. Damn, they sound good. Got the beautiful C8 rolling out as well. Shout out to Kevin. That sounds good, the Super Sport. Wow. Wow, that's a nice, man, that is so clean. That was like a loss of words. Well, nice GTRs. You got the really nice Nismo. And next to that, a Ferrari. Look at that. All right, we got the Supra. It looks a lot like our friend Rob's old Supra. And next to them, we got Lumpia's. I've been seeing this one for years. Definitely one of my favorite M2s. There he is right there talking to Erica. Super clean, nice wheels. And yeah, the reason why I call it Lumpia, I'll show you guys, is because it literally says Lumpia right there on the plate. That carbon fiber diffuser. The super, oh, I just noticed the super wheels. Really nice on that. Super nice competition. Yeah, that's a, it's, it's funny. Yeah, yeah, it's different for sure. It's, it's almost like a light bar in the front. Yeah, like, it's cool. Oh, I didn't even realize up close that it actually says Rivian in the headlights. Look at that. No, this can lift for sure. That's how crazy how it looks. Oh, oh that's. It's a good amount though. We'll give you a look at the inside of the Rivian. Oh, shoot, this is nice. Look at this, it's almost like wood. Steering wheel is nice too. We got what looks like a tablet there. And another tablet, huge tablet there. Center console, plenty of space. Look at the seats. And it's all Oh, no kidding. Yeah, that's like some family stuff, you know, but instead of an umbrella, you got a flashlight. That's neat, dude. No way that pops out. Oh, no way. <laughs> Check out the back. Oh, it's got like a wink for downforce. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's in right now, the light bars. So That's the light bar there. That will give you an overall look of the Rivian. I think it's sick. All right, back in the Alfa Romeo. And as we're headed home, check out this GT3. Beautiful color. Ooh, really nice color. 